Hello. Rough night, Zoe is getting her two top teeth in, so she's keeping us up all night. If anything, that just makes you work more efficiently. So that's what I want to talk about. So the other day I did eight different pieces at once. So this video is on how to coat multiple pieces at once, some tips and tricks. You know, if you have a show coming up or you have lots of pieces that you want to art resin, get them all done. One, get them level and on stands all before you even start pouring. Two, cut some cardboard boxes and make them to the shape of each of the pieces so that you, when you're done, you can just put a box over top and then protect it from dust and hair. So you just make a box shape that's like, just cut it like that shape, fold these up, and tape them and you get stuff like this, right? Three, you don't wanna mix up a big bucket and do them all at once. Just plan to do like two at a time. So mix up a batch for two of them, pour it, spread it, get rid of the bubbles, cover it. Then mix up your next batch. It's just easier and then you know, you can make sure those ones are perfect as opposed to doing a big bucket and then really rushing to get them all perfect. So I'll just show you each of the pieces and then I'll come up with some other tips. Two pieces of wood, so perfect. How nice that is. So now we have all these little bits. I'm just gonna use a hand file and get rid of all those. You could embed things underneath that. That's rock hard, it's food safe. Eat off of it and you're fine. This one's just another piece of wood. This is walnut, perfect. And a live edge for, that's after. I just art resin some arrowroot cookies and they ended up like soaking up most of the resin. So I'll probably have to do another coat. But I was gonna put magnets on the back just to see what would happen. Next over here, this is a bigger painting. Oh yeah, nice. Oh, I love it. This middle part, I put in some glow-in-the-dark pigment so that the eye will glow. Love it. So I have that video on how to mount a photo and resin it. So this is pre-resined. Oh yeah, look at that. So exact same prints, one with resin, one without. Anyways, yeah, perfect, 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 perfect. So these are called plaster paintings. Basically, it's with wallboard plaster. Two, yeah, nice. And those are just nice little side table things. Yes. Okay, now this is one of my favorite paintings that I've ever done, actually. Now, when I did this piece, I anticipated having to do two coats of art resin because it has really high texture. Some of the little bits stick up. So I'm doing the first coat of resin, then I'm gonna sand the whole thing down, get rid of the high bits, and then do a second finishing coat. So here's how it turned out. Just love it. Yeah, I'm really happy with it. See the texture? So no problem. So I'll do a video on that. I'm just gonna sand the heck out of it and then do another coat. Okay, so hopefully that was helpful. Just a very fast video just on being efficient. If you have any questions, comment below. Check out artresin.com. We have an FAQ and lots of other how-to videos. Hashtag artresin. And once a month, we'll randomly pick and they will get sent a free one gallon studio kit of artresin. I think that's it. Thanks, love ya.